Hey gang, Jack Alair here. Just with kind of a semi-quick Gorilla Pickups video. Managed to find this little guy, the Radio Shack Electronics TV scoreboard at a local thrift store. And they had it in. They had the box, not tested. Uh, Four ninety four, and it looked really cool and reminded me of, you know, the the days of going to Radio Shack and actually finding cool stuff. It's got four remote, remote control games plus two shooting games. You know, target, practice, hockey, squash, skeet, and tennis. Which most of those are pong and pong and pong. Four popular shooting games, photoelectric pistol. And it's got a bunch of stuff on the back. And actually looks uh, pretty cool. Remember those TVs, guys? All the knobs. Oh. Anyways. So yeah, so I picked it up, opened the box, and of course inside the box was a, a USB cable, which has nothing to do with it, a audio cable, which has nothing to do with it, but it does let me know, in case I want to give this to my child, hold on, focus. This audio cable is a potential strangle hazard. Product is not intended for children under age 8. Parental supervision is recommended. So I'm going to give this to my 10-year-old uh, and just say, Here, have fun. See what he does. Anyways, <clears throat> beside the point, I had the instruction manual in it, which was really cool. And it's, I mean, it's back to the old days of like, Hey, here's the picture and a bunch of text and it's actually supposed to have the old uh, switch thing now I'm just gonna buy one of the little uh, adapters at Radio Shack for a normal connection connection of the pistol it connects into the top there and it's got the rules for playing the games kinda cool and then it's got the main unit itself it's actually really cool. It's got the your game select button up here, your power button, the ball speed, bat size, slice, I don't know what that's for, and serve whether it's auto or manual. It's got serve, reset, oh, oh I could listen to that noise all day. Anyways, and it's got a right player and left player and of course this detaches and ah, hang on and goes back on there you go all right and then i find dun, 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 there's a plug for the gun and some filthy hippie has cut off the cord to the gun. And I have no clue where I'm going to find that. But the battery compartment actually had batteries from 1980 in it, or thereabouts. I don't remember the exact year, but it was early 80s. And I'm waiting for it to dry out, and then we're going to give it a shot and see how it goes. So I'll uh, put a video to update you guys later. Thanks for watching, and as always, play on with your TV scoreboard. Dun dun dun.